four years ago, together with my family, we were on a trip in Asia, and we were talking about the future of our children. And I had the feeling to look very deeply into education systems around the world. After some initial research, I saw how big the gap is between real life and what's happening right now in education systems and schools around the world. I've been very aware for the last couple of decades that the education structures around the world have failed. Kids are coming out from the school system and they don't know what they want to do and they get into the wrong course or into the wrong job. Our intention is to totally change that paradigm into something that's more um, relevant to a future. What we are doing here is trying to redefine, reinvent, recreate learning and education in a way that we take the learner in the center point and it's not anymore about trying to standardize everybody through one tunnel but seeing again that you know each one of our children is a unique human being and understanding that when we build learning on top of that it's, it's a completely different world. Well as the director of this space I look very closely at the smile index uh, our learners need to arrive smiling, our learners need to leave smiling, uh, really trying to put together the most wonderful experience day after day here that's different, that's motivating, that's exciting, that's touching on their passions and on their purpose in life. I'm working on pursuing my um, professional ballet career. I learn a new language, so I've been trying to learn Dutch. Recently I've been working on practicing painting. I started by working on a weather detector that uses artificial intelligence. At the moment I've been working on fashion. I've learned a lot of coding and I'm trying to learn more like robotics. We have wonderful learning guides capable of doing amazing things with learners who are discovering every day and exploring their passions and their purpose in life. Yes, beautiful. I get uh, many questions like, what do you work? And like, I'm the closest that you can guess is that I'm a teacher, but I'm not a teacher. And they ask me, okay, so what do you teach then? And I was like, I'm teaching life. It's a pretty interesting thing. In my opinion, the learning guides are not here to teach us anything. They're here to help us and hold our hands through the journey that we're taking here. I used to be scared of the teachers, not want to speak to them, but um, here I feel like a weird connection to them, like friendship in a way. I think the role of a learning guide is many, many things. Uh, we are passion pushers, we are cheerleaders, we are guides, we are mentors. Uh, the way we interact with our learners and the way we design our learning experiences are very different from what I've gotten to know as a teacher. I think the most important thing to remember is as a learning guide, you're actually a learner. To be, put yourself in the shoes of a learner and actually re, kind of rediscover the fact that you are still a learner. I think most importantly, the focus is on building really strong, healthy relationships with learners as the, uh, the centerpiece for our approach. There's no two days are alike here. We're trying to promote creation, we're trying to promote adaptation, we're trying to promote uh, flexibility, uh, embracing change. The world that is ahead of us is going to demand flexibility. It's going to demand being flexible and being able to change. So uh, we don't necessarily want to fall into too much of a, a routine. Um, we like to change it up. My experience here has been really nice and the fact that I could um learn while I'm dancing and doing my own thing uh, just makes me really, really happy. It's actually pretty wild. It's, it's been nothing but positive. It's so different to old school. Honestly, it's been easier like transitioning to here than like just living a day at a traditional school. I didn't have any high hopes when I came in, but it's been such a pleasant thing that honestly, I'm super satisfied. I'm definitely more happy and people are just more open and like 
Oh, completely different. I would say it's almost mon monumentally different. There's no reason why anyone should not enjoy learning. The only reason they don't enjoy learning is because the system is wrong. Welcome to your journey of why.